Hello everybody, my name is The Seven Worlds Gaming on YouTube and today I'm going to be talking to you about something cool that has happened after update 0.5.0. If you are not aware of it, the update is now out. So if you want to go ahead and update your game, there's going to be a link in the description below where you'll be able to click on there and it will send you to update your game. Now, this video is going to go ahead and be about custom matches and especially expectator mode because what the developers have been able to do it has been absolutely amazing i'm gonna go ahead and show you just some of the stuff that has changed with custom matches first of all if you ever want to just go ahead and join a custom match what you're gonna want to go ahead and do is you're gonna actually want to go ahead and just tap on the option that says room and it's currently being highlighted by an arrow now once you go into room if there's any custom matches it will pop up right there if it does need to enter a password then it will pop up this section right here once you select to go in it just go ahead and type in the password keep in mind the pan password was just for this custom match it might change in the future and i'm just gonna go ahead and select myself to expectate there because i'm not actually gonna be playing the game it's just gonna go ahead and be somebody else but we'll be watching them and this is pretty much the setup that is currently at the lobby of a custom match you are able to select the server you are able to select what kind of game mode solo duo or squads and you will be able now to select the map that you want and if you're just waiting in this lobby you're just gonna have to go ahead and wait until everything loads up what i'm gonna go ahead and do now is just fast forward a little bit and show you what an actual custom match looks like on the miramar map and right here you're currently watching some free roam camera just on the pre-game lobby of the miramar map i'm gonna go ahead and show you a team landing i am gonna be expecting some squads so keep that in mind what you're currently seeing on the screen i'm gonna break it down for you right now on the top left hand side you're able to see the name of the squad that you're currently expecting if you go a little bit higher it will tell you there is 99 people alive and how many people the person that you're currently watching has killed obviously he's currently parachuting so he's not gonna have a chance to kill anybody yet but on the bottom right hand side it would actually give you a heads up of who you're currently watching and if you tap on that name you will be able to switch in between players from the current squad that you're watching and as you can see right here it is a little bit laggy but please keep in mind that this feature is being worked on a lot now if you're still spectating somebody and you actually want to be able to go into free roam you're gonna want to go ahead and just tap on the little world on the bottom left hand side and then you'll be able to start moving around and before i actually show you some of the really cool action shots that i was able to capture in this game i'm gonna go ahead and just teach you a little bit more about expectator mode and the controllers in case you ever find yourself in a situation where you'll be expectating and who knows maybe you'll catch yourself casting some of the matches that might be happening in the future now on the left hand side with that analog stick you'll actually be able to move around and just explore the whole area now if you want to go ahead and just look around you will go ahead and just swipe on the right hand side of your screen just as if you were playing a match and as you can see right there i was able to just go back into a character and just watch him and then just go ahead and switch back to free roam camera and just some more action right here now if you just wish to go ahead and go up and down you can actually go ahead and just use the arrows on the right hand side those are just gonna go ahead and have you go straight up and straight down as i mentioned with the left analog stick you will be able to go anywhere as long as you point at it if you want to go up high you can actually go ahead and go up high with that left analog stick just make sure you're pointing towards it or if you want to go ahead and look down you can definitely go ahead and do so as well and let me go ahead and show you a little bit more of the power of X spectator mode so right here i didn't think training nominee had an angle on him so i decided to go ahead and switch towards them and as you can see right here I thought he had an angle it turns out Jay Patel actually ended up getting an angle on him and knocking him down nonetheless the stuff that you're able to do with X spectator mode at the moment is absolutely insane you can go through walls you don't have to worry about anything and the flying is just absolutely smooth you will be able to follow the action if you are in X spectator mode in any way you want now the reason why I'm so excited about this mode coming to PUBG mobile is because look at this example right here training nominee is gonna go ahead and try to heal up his friend what is love little does he know there's two enemies to his left hand side he's able to shoot one down right there yet the other enemy is able to come up behind him and shoot him down and we're also able to see the exchange happening between training nominee's teammate and back pusha so definitely 
it is absolutely amazing and as you can tell right here it is super super smooth the way this is working and keep in mind this is just on a phone and this is a feature that has been improving throughout every single update so i cannot wait to have access to custom matches and maybe be able to run tournaments myself on my channel or just be able to have custom matches with just ridiculous stuff like pants only and just a bunch of stuff that we can go ahead and make for the community and have a lot of fun with and just be able to smile more and i'm just gonna go ahead and show you some action shots right here that i was able to capture in x spectator mode so definitely go ahead and enjoy them and we'll be right back And there you have it right there, Expectator Mode in custom matches in PUBG Mobile on update 0.5.0. If you have not updated your device already, make sure you check the link in the description below. Just click on that and it will send you directly to where you need to go to update your game. Now, let me know in the comments below, what do you guys think about all this? As I mentioned throughout this video, I cannot wait just to see where this goes with the game. Maybe we'll even get an esports scene for PUBG Mobile. That'll just be the best. If you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. It has been the 7 Worlds Gaming. And I'm going to go ahead and see you in the next one.